Good morning, littles. Little Vincent, little Ellie. I have some more stories today. This one is a really cute one. It is called No T-Rex in the Library. Wow. There wouldn't be room for a T-Rex in Grandma's library. They're really big. Let's see what happens. It's Tuesday morning in the library. There's a little girl. She's going with her mama to the library. And the little girl, her name is Tess, and she's growling. Roar. And she's throwing stuff around. Wow. Tess is out of control. Uh-oh, there's her mommy. Mommy says, time out. No beastie behavior in the library. Wow. Tess doesn't look like she likes that very well. Let's see. Tess snarls. She snorts. Wow, she's having a really bad day. Just ten quiet minutes, little beastie, says Mommy, and then I'll be back for you. Wow. Ten minutes is a long time. A long, long time for a time out. She doesn't look very happy about it. Bam! Books tumble Topple, flop on the floor. Goodness, something's making a mess. I wonder if Tess is doing that. Ooh, you know what? I see a T-Rex there. Let's look on the other page. The T-Rex is a little smaller in this picture. And the T-Rex is bigger in this one. It looks like his tail is coming out of the book. What? <gasps> Oops, Tess says. The books. Roar. She gasps and grins. She grips a claw. And then it looks like this T-Rex is coming out of that book. He's getting bigger. So it's not Tess that's making a mess now. It's the T-Rex. He came out of a book. T-Rex zips through the children's room. Tess bumps along on his back. Yeehaw, Tess cheers. And all the kids are running away. Oh, my goodness. Readers scatter in the wild clatter of the history books tumbling down. Watch out, Tess shouts. The books. That T-Rex is just running wild in the library. My goodness, the children are running away. Now, knights in gleaming armor lay siege, hoisting their flags and wheeling their steeds. They're trying to stop the T-Rex. Charge on, Tess trumpets. T-Rex tilts and whirls through the door. Wait, Tess shouts, the books. She doesn't want the T-Rex to hurt the books. Water spills as the story pit fills with fish and aquarium treasures. Wow, now T-Rex is in the water. Orcas spout high, swordfish, jellies, and squid reel by, the knights doing synchronized swimming. That's funny. T-Rex cannonballs through them all. T 
T-Rex is playing in that water. And bubbles up, guarding the treasure. A swashbuckling pirate surfaces nearby, brandishing a hook for a hand. Arr! Return me booty, scurvy dog. He's, he's pretending to be a pirate. He's got an eye patch on. And Tess is still riding on him. T-Rex escapes through the Wild West display, stomping past books on the floor. Be careful, Tess cries. The books. He's just running around the library like crazy, and she doesn't want him to hurt the books. A posse of cowboys gallops up off the pages, their lassoes a twirl overhead. All these people are coming out of the books. T-Rex reels through the sagebrush and books. Cattle stampede at his heels. Wow, there are so many stories in books. Stories about everything. Take care, Tess pleads. The books. T-Rex thrashes and trashes, grabbing masses and mounds. And he builds the shelves, mountains of books, and escape to the stars. Looks like he's making uh, some stairs out of the books. This is really an interesting story. Now they're in the section about Earth and science. Wow. Tess is learning a lot in her time out. From M to Mars. Please don't, Tess whispers. From J to Jupiter. No, no, Tess exclaims. From S to Saturn. Please stop. They're ripping, she begs. Let's see. There's Saturn. Saturn has the rings about around it. I think you know about that one, Ellie. Please stop. They're ripping, she begs. And on to the T-Rex is looks like he's gonna eat the books. Wow. Jake likes to bite books sometimes. He doesn't eat them, but he just bites them. Rip, roar. Oh no, he's tearing up the books. Bud used to tear up books when he was little. He was acting like a little baby T-Rex. Time out, Tess shouts. Wow. This T-Rex is causing a lot of trouble. You're out of control, Tess growls. No beastie behavior with my library books. Wow. T-Rex fidgets. He fusses. He flings out his tail. He's still getting into mischief. He's, he's doing shenanigans in the library. Bam! Books tumble, topple, flop on the floor. Roar! Tess pushes and pokes him. She presses him into his book. She's trying to put him back in the storybook. There he goes. Yeah, he's almost all in the book. Wow. Just ten quiet minutes, little beastie, Tess whispers, and then I'll be back for you. She had to stuff him right back in the book. I think she better close up the book so the T-Rex doesn't get out again 
and do more shenanigans.